What's up guys, this is Van from Ors, and today I have an extreme product to show you guys. This right here, if I can bring it out without hurting myself, is the brand new, just launched, X570 Aorus Extreme. This is the flagship motherboard of the Aorus X570 lineup. Let's talk about some of the biggest features and go over the design changes that we've done for this generation. Let's do this. Okay, so let's start off by doing a unboxing of this. Okay, let's... Dude, look at this box, it's so crazy. Such a nice packaging. Premium packaging for a premium product. Let's set this aside. Oh, dude, check this out. This is what we're looking after today. So, check this out. See how big this thing is? You guys can't feel it, but trust me, dude, this thing is super heavy. Okay, but we're gonna set this aside for just a couple minutes. We're gonna go more about what's inside the box, and then we're gonna come revisit the motherboard. Oh man, what are we gonna get here? Oh, stickers, of course. Can't forget their stickers. You're gonna have your usual array of paperwork. Okay, so something else you're gonna get inside the box. Ooh, interesting. This is the Aorus RGB Fan Commander. You guys might have seen it before, but if you guys haven't, let me quickly explain what this thing's all about. This thing right here is kind of like a, a hub. So you're gonna connect all of your uh, fans, your RGB strips into here, and this thing connects to your motherboard via USB and basically controls everything. So again, we include this inside the box with the X570 Aorus Extreme. So it's a nice bonus that you get when you're picking up this motherboard. If you guys want to find out more information about this thing right here, um, let us know in the comments below. We can always do some more follow-up videos on this and talk to you guys exactly about what that's all about. Okay, check this out. Cables aplenty. So you're gonna get your RGB cables, additional SATA cables, uh, Wi-Fi antenna, Wi-Fi antenna, Velcro ties, additional screws and standards. Oh, hey, nice. USB flash drive. We'll include this in the box now with the X570 Aorus Master. Don't miss on this one. And yeah, that was quickly putting all this aside. Oh, can't forget, Gigabyte G connector. Basically, you connect all your front panel connectors to here. This goes to the motherboard. Super nice and easy. Okay, so that's it when it comes to the accessories. Uh, the trouble is how we're gonna clean this up. I know what to do. Oh, dude, Thanos would be proud. Anyways, let's move over to the main star of the show, X570 Aorus Extreme. And dude, I'm having a workout just by holding this. Main reason being, you guys can see, this is an EATX motherboard. And you can see how much heat sinks are on here. First up, yeah, I wanna talk about heat sinks. So pretty much this thing is a gigantic heat sink, front and back. So because of that, we really wanted to focus on the cooling aspect of this motherboard. So when it comes to cooling, let's break down some of the biggest cooling components on here. First one being the heat sinks. So we have a thin array heat sink. Again, this is upgraded for X570 generation. So it's new and improved. You're gonna get a very large heat pipe running across and down to the board. I don't know if you guys can see it, but that thing is absolutely crazy. Once you get down here, Pretty much a gigantic slab of metal. Again, this is used for heat dissipation. Basically, it's gonna cover your M.2 slots. It's gonna cover the chipset area. It's gonna cover the side area over here. And we're gonna continue over to the back. And again, this whole thing right here, it's a back plate, yes, but it's also helping with heat dissipation on this platform. The reason why we wanted to focus so much on heat dissipation is because on this motherboard, we put a direct 16 phase power design on here. So that's absolutely crazy. If you're looking to pick up the new Ryzen 3000 series processor and you're looking to push it via overclocking, um, pushing to do uh, liquid cooling or, or whatever it is you wanna do, this board is basically gonna be the best option for you when it comes to that type of stuff. So probably by now, at this point in the video, you guys are probably in awe of the design. So I'm gonna add a little bit of an extra thing for you guys. I'm gonna plug in this very nice and convenient RGB cable. Show you guys what it looks like when it's lit up. And check it out. So we have RGB Fusion 2.0 lighting on here. So again, this syncs with your Aorus graphics cards, your Aorus RAM, your Aorus CPU coolers, mice, keyboards, whatever you call it. Aorus, it syncs up with our whole ecosystem. And something that I also want to point out is for this generation, X570, the design, we've completely redesigned it. So now it's a very flat black and silver color scheme. It's a very neutral color scheme. So whatever build you're trying to go for, red, white, black, blue, 
this motherboard right here pretty much goes perfectly with those colors. Another thing I wanna talk about is if I shift it over to this side right here. So you can see all 90 degree connectors over here because this is an EATX board. Um, we did design this this way because it's easier to install into your PC, easier to plug in all the cables that you need. Okay, so let's flip this board around 180 and talk about IO. Like many other Aorus motherboards, this one's gonna come with an integrated IO shield, nice extra touch. Also, if you take a closer look, you're gonna see lots and lots of connectivity. USB, USB 3.0, USB 3.1 Gen 2, USB Type-C on the back, and a header for USB-C on the front as well. Also, when we're taking a look at the back, you're gonna see the inclusion of two LAN ports. Your standard gigabit ethernet LAN port, but you're gonna get the addition of a 10 gigabit ethernet LAN from Aquantia. So this is a really nice touch, especially if you're gonna buy a flagship motherboard. Also, this thing includes Wi-Fi 6 technology. This is the latest generation in Wi-Fi. So if you pair this with a compatible AX motherboard, you're gonna get upgraded speeds and it's gonna be really nice to help future-proof whatever setup you're trying to do. Another big thing I wanna point out on this motherboard is the audio solution. So this one, you're gonna get an upgraded ESS9218 DAC. Basically, this is gonna deliver better audio quality for your PC. So if you're looking to play games, if you're looking to watch the most immersive movies, or if you're looking to do music production, it's nice to know that you don't have to buy an external sound card because this motherboard has it built in. Also, like all other X570 Aorus motherboards, you're gonna see the inclusion of PCI Express 4.0 on here. So you're gonna get the next generation of connectivity. So PCIe 4 SSDs, which Aorus also makes. You get PCIe 4 graphics cards, which will come, and it's gonna work perfectly with this motherboard. So again, this is kind of the latest generation of technologies. Pretty much everything new is on this board. Everything that you need is on the X570 Aorus Extreme. So who should consider purchasing this motherboard? Well, if you are a really big overclocker, if you're a big enthusiast, if you're planning to push your PC to do maximum rendering, maximum gameplay performance, this extreme motherboard right here is gonna be a great platform for you to use and do whatever it is you need to do. Also alongside this motherboard, we're launching the brand new PCIe Gen 4 SSDs from Aorus and we have new graphics cards and even new monitors. So if you guys wanna check out some more of that stuff, follow Aorus on social media and YouTube, and we're gonna have more content coming really soon. If you guys are interested in picking up this board, check out the links below. We're gonna give you guys the best places and prices for you guys to pick this up. I know there's a lot of features and technology that we put inside this motherboard. So if you guys wanna see us go more in depth and talk about specific parts of the motherboard, let us know in the comments below and we'll do a follow-up video for you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick overview of the Aorus X570 Extreme motherboard. This is the flagship motherboard and this thing is just absolutely crazy. My name is Van from Aorus and we'll see you guys on the next video.